In this tutorial we will be learning how to make a good brush cleaner. This is a one gallon can that will hold your mineral spirits or whatever product you use to clean your brushes. Normally your brush cleaner is the most dangerous thing on your palette. The vapors that are released when you clean your brush or when you disturb the brush cleaner are released into the air. You should have a good exhaust system in your studio but if you don't you need to be aware that breathing these vapors can be dangerous to you over time. So for this project you'll need a one gallon can. You'll need some bird screen. This bird screen you can buy at Home Depot or Lowe's or your local home center. This product is used to keep birds out of vents on top of your roof. You need a pair of tin snips which will cut the metal. Make sure you save the plastic top for your one gallon coffee can because it's going to be the top of the can that will keep the vapors from moving into your studio when you're not using the can. The first thing we'll do is measure the bird screen. Cut your screen about two to three inches bigger all the way around the can. You probably should be wearing gloves with this. You have to be extra careful with this metal because it can cut your finger or cut your hand. Now we'll cut the corners off of the screen about a 45 degree angle. You're just kind of rounding it off here. I'll do a little more trimming. Okay, now what you want to do is about every inch all the way around the bird screen, cut in toward the middle about two inches. We're going to bend this metal up so it will fit down into the bottom of the can. Now lay the screen on top of the can and bend the screen up so the screen will eventually fit inside the can. Again, be careful not to cut your fingers. Turn the screen over, make sure it fits in the can. It's about three to four inches tall. When you rub your brush over it, your brush gets clean because the pigment is being knocked off of the brush and the pigment drops to the bottom of the can. As a result, your mineral spirit stays much cleaner. And of course, when you rub your brush across the screen, it cleans the brush. Pour your mineral spirits. Whatever mineral spirits you normally use. Pour the mineral spirits about one inch above the top of the screen. You can see when your brush is rubbed over the bird screen, your pigment will fall to the bottom of the can and keep your mineral spirits clean and also it will clean your brush much better. Now the last thing we do is put the top on the can to reduce the risk of vapors getting into our studio. So make your own brush cleaner. It's easy and inexpensive. Thanks for watching.